Greetings commanders and welcome. Testing the target frameshift drive. 3, 2, 1, here we go. Your ship goes fantastically fast. 80% more speed in super cruise, but your heat is going to the roof. And on the right, you see the fuel consumption. It consumes a whole lot of fuel, but if you do it in burst jumps, you can get pretty far with that. Anyway, let's take a look at the module. So this is it. Frameshift drive SCO class C. It is always a class C. If you want to know a station sell it, for one thing, they are selling it in high tech systems. So check the galaxy map, filter out everything that is not high tech and go there and you will find. But if you're in a station, go buy and store core frame shift drive and here you will see all the classes that I have but right now I am, I am in a Jameson Memorial so here you have you have all the modules so it starts with a 7 all the way down to a 2C so even a sidewinder can put that technology but it has a lot of downsides for once heating up very fast drinking your fuel like beer but if you look at the jump range it has only 16.67 light years Compared to my uh, A-rated frameshift drive, it will give me, sorry, it will give me 33 light years. And they cannot be engineered. I have the blueprint for the FSD, but if I go to the engineer workshop, it's not showing me the FSD. That means you cannot engineer the frameshift drive. Now that is all set, how does it work? If you're in super cruise, it doesn't matter if you're full speed or just uh, throttle down in super cruise, you will hit your boost button, the button you use in regular speed to use your thrusters. So here we go. And keep an eye on your heat. Not to overheat, but still, this is what I call the burst jump. There is a cooldown on uh, the FSD as you can see but there is no meter so you don't know when the cooldown is done but see I can use it again keep an eye on your heat the fuel consumption is still pretty okay and that is what I say it's very good for boost jumping because right now we are ready if you look back at Jameson Memorial so that was like two, one or two seconds boost. But we already have a distance from Jameson like almost 2000 light seconds. So it is also a thing. I don't think you're going to get interdicted if you use this because you go damn too fast. Even if another commander will have that module, I don't think you can use it. In uh, you cannot use the FSD interdictor when you are using the boost it's just not possible it goes so fast anyway thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video